The Fairphone 4 is our most sustainable smartphone yet. It's made with fair and recycled materials and it's built to last. The really special part? It's yours to open, yours to repair and yours to keep. That means that no part of this phone is permanently glued, so you can easily repair it yourself with a standard screwdriver. In this video, we'll guide you through the simple steps to get started with your new Fairphone 4. From opening it up and removing the battery to inserting the SIM card and starting it up. Since we're taking out the battery for this one, make sure your Fairphone is turned off by pressing the power button on the side of your phone and selecting power off on your screen. Now let's take off the back cover by separating it from the aluminum frame with your finger. There's a designated notch on the bottom right side of your phone when the screen is facing down. You'll hear a nice click once it disconnects. Make sure to start there and work your way around until the back cover comes all the way off. To take out the battery, simply lift it from the white triangle at the bottom. Insert your nano SIM card into the slot, with the connector facing down and the little diagonal cutoff on the top right. It will connect with a satisfying click. And yes, there's only one SIM card slot, even though the Fairphone 4 is a dual SIM smartphone. That's because the second SIM card has to be an eSIM, which is activated via software. Curious how to set that up with your mobile network operator? Your Fairphone 4 setup wizard will guide you through the process. Below that, you'll find the micro SD card slot. Your memory card of choice connects the same way your SIM card does. If you need support with formatting your SD card, we have a handy support article for you, linked below. Now you're ready to put the battery back. Make sure to start with the top and lay it down like this. Click the back cover back in place and press along the sides with your finger to make sure the fit is snug and secure. Turn on your Fairphone 4 by pressing the power button on the side of your phone. And that's it, you're all set.